Hi, this is a demo embedding a prototype made with ProPy inside a 3D or VR Unity project. As you can see, I'm driving around in this 3D environment inside Unity. Apologies in advance for all the terrible driving in this video. The HMI UI that you see in front of the driver's seat and the center display is actually made with ProPy, not Unity. With this setup, you can quickly iterate on your HMI UI with ProPy. This can save designers time uh, and make them more efficient in testing their HMI UIs in 3D environments without having to go through uh, more complicated authoring tools. As you can see, the game's vehicle speed is reflected in our HMI design made with ProtoPy. When we're driving above 60 km per hour, we're also showing the speed warning to the user. To foster safer driving, let's say we want to make the speed warning more visible and apparent. We can easily do that inside ProtoPy and have the results reflected immediately inside our Unity environment. So let's do that. So I have the Pi inside uh, ProtoPy Studio. Let's make some changes to the interaction details inside the Pi. Uh, when the speed is above 60 km per hour, let's make the background animate to red as to warn the driver to slow down. Maybe we can also make it pulsate faster when the speed is faster. I made the interactions ahead of time, and let's apply the changes to the other screen as well. I save both Pi's and ProPy Connect will magically make sure all these changes are reflected inside Unity project as well. As you can see, the design changes that we've applied in ProPy have been reflected immediately inside our Unity project. Now the driver may be more properly warned to slow down ahead of time. Without having to make these UI changes inside Unity, which could take the designer a fair bit of time and effort to do, the designer can easily make these changes inside ProtoPy and get the same results. The whole setup is enabled by ProtoPy Connect, which glues everything together to make it work. It is responsible for handling all the data communication between the prototypes and Unity, and also allows ProtoPy prototypes to be in a format which can be embedded in Unity 3D environments. We'll provide a more detailed step-by-step -step tutorial in a separate link, so make sure to check that out. We'll show you how to get started with the Unity templates, how to create web view objects for embedding uh, prototypes made with ProtoPy, and also how to create a small script which allows data communication to happen between Unity and ProtoPy. So hope this video was helpful and useful. If you have any questions or want to see more advanced demos like this using ProtoPy, please let us know in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe to our channels. Great, happy prototyping and thank you for watching. Take care.